Today, we are discussing the six chatbot builders that I am using to build my million dollar AI automation agency in 30 days. By the end of 30 days, the goal is to have a business that does $83,333 a month. Today is day four and we will be learning the chatbot builders that I am using for my agency. This is by far one of the most requested topics. So let's start with BotPress. BotPress is a great chatbot builder. If you're just starting out and your client doesn't need a huge database, if they only have a small frequently asked questions and a few documents here and there, then BotPress would be really great in that situation. Few great things about BotPress is they have a ton of integrations. There are over 100 plus templates. One of the features that I really like in BotPress is the ability to customize your answer based on the prospect's previous responses. If you look at this code snippet, prospect says that they are struggling with nutrition. We can say we help you lose weight without giving up the foods you love. So based on whether they said nutrition, exercise or accountability, the answer would be changing. And you can do that in multiple steps. Chatbots previously wouldn't be able to do that. There are some features that all of these chatbots have like customization or sharing the bot link to the client before the delivery so they can test it give you feedback etc i won't be covering that for all of these bots and they follow a really clear pricing with free plan you'll be getting 1000 incoming messages each month as you go up for 5025 dollars $10, $25 for every 5,000 messages or so. You might be wondering what an incoming message is. You can read the frequently asked questions here. If you click the knowledge base here, do documents, web pages, web search, text document. Not many data loaders if you look at it. As, as we move forward in this video, you will see the amount of data loaders that are available on Flowwise and Stack AI. BotPress has API integration. You need to add this bit of code here. There are two ways to get this code. You can just type in here what you need or you can use ChatGPT to generate the code snippets for the API calls. If you don't like to do that, you will love the next chatbot builder. They deal with one of the best brands on the planet like Google, Home Depot, JP Morgan, and all of these. The, these are the go-to guys. These are at the enterprise level. So obviously their product would be really great. And it's really intuitive. It's really easy to use. The cards itself, the nodes, when I used both BotPress and VoiceFlow, VoiceFlow was really smooth and, and the code part that I was speaking about earlier, you don't have to even write that code snippet. If you can see here, this is one of the nodes where you can get dev and API. Once you have this API node, all you need to do is get this post, the content type and stuff and you'll be done. It's just copy and pasting. It's so easy. And one of the features that I also like, this is a welcome message. You can generate a variant. So the chatbot message would be different each time. And the knowledge base on VoiceFlow as well, it only has 10 MB limit, URL, sitemap, text, PDF, and doc, and that's it. And again, it connects to Zapier, or make and you can automate lead capturing etc let's talk about pricing as well sandbox is which is a free plan has 100000 ai tokens and their pro plan 40 dollars per month 1 million monthly tokens so let's quickly compare these two and what i think about it first features wise both of these are feature rich so both for the win easy to use because the people that are that don't want to touch code at all 
can get away with using voice flow that's why the ease of use will go to voice flow and finally the pricing bot press is really straightforward and you pay for the messages that you use but in case of voice flow it's not that clear you can get charged 800 tokens or 1500 even 3000 we never know right i also read a million tokens cost only five dollars so it's something that you can consider if you really want to go with voice flow next up we have flowwise ai flowwise ai is one of the best if not the best open source tool you could ever hope for as an ai automation agency on because langchain revolutionized what we could do with ai application development flowwise took it to a whole new level where you can now as a non-coder come in and leverage langchain to build your application with just drag and drop that is so powerful flowwise will be able to handle a huge amount of data and there are a lot of document loaders as well where you these can be any type of documents including folders sql databases but since we're in this section i want to tell you that it's important to learn about langchain especially if you are beginning out and you want to sound knowledgeable and confident with your clients i strongly recommend that you go to deep learning ai and there is a course called langchain for llm application development if you finish that course you would be so much knowledgeable when it comes to how these chatbots are working behind the scenes how you can solve your clients problems more effectively the next app that we have is stack ai the reason that i am using stack ai in some cases is stack ai is definitely more robust than flowwise ai if you look at in one of my videos these are all the data loaders that you can use right away example airtable hubspot salesforce clients will love it it's you don't have to figure out and take that data into a document and connect it to your chatbot that would be too much imagine a client is using salesforce or hubspot or airtable you come in you connect your chatbot your chatbot pulls the data in real time that makes a huge difference so that's why i like using stack ai for its features that ready to go data loaders don't get me wrong you can get a lot of things done with flowwise ai no questions about that but if you want to take it to the next level service those premium clients you will need stack ai when it comes to flowwise ai pricing it is completely free and open source but you have to still pay for let's say server deployment you that could be render replet or railway you also need to pay for pinecone or superbase that vector databases indexes and one more charge would be llm charges whether it's open ai whichever llm you use you will incur fees for that and pricing for stack ai since it's a uh, is on the premium side their starter plan 199 dollars a month and you can do up to three projects do i recommend stack ai yes if you have clients that are paying and are premium then stack ai makes total sense if not you can achieve a lot with flowwise ai let's quickly compare these two and see what high feel about these two chatbot builders flowwise ai has a lot of features it's just my opinion and comparison here if you look at the ease of use both are so easy to use it's just drag and drop for everything and i didn't really find flowwise ai that slow or bad or anything negative at all it's just comparing to stack ai it has less features and that's it for pricing 
absolutely flow wise ai to the win stack ai it's a tie again you have to decide between whether you need those extra features those ex extra data loaders to connect in real time or the price there you have it if you are getting value from this hit that like button and subscribe to my channel to follow along with my journey so that's two categories of bots down the first one is bot press and voice flow these two bots have limited knowledge bases both of these are really great for that conversation flow automating flows with zapier or make if the knowledge base is really small these are perfect as standalone tools if you have a larger knowledge base that you need to do things in real time that's where second category of bot builders come in which is flowwise ai and stack ai now we come on to third category of bots yesterday i managed to create 83 chatbots using oremon.ai it is really fast it took around less than a minute connect the website and the bot learning that website and tweaking a little bit of branding adding their company name personality etc it took less than two minutes to finish the whole bot these bots may not be ideal to sell it as it is i am personally using this as an outreach bot there are some really great things about oremon ai as you can see you can set a different api key for different chatbots so you, it's easier to track what kind of usage your client is doing and you can actually set the number of messages that you want to allot to a particular bot and if you look at the prompts personality section here that is where you can set whether you need sales support reader custom whatever it is definitely allows for a lot of customization you can use this bot as a final delivery to the client as long as they are okay with the responses that the bot is giving because it is still using gpt 3.5 turbo and you can have a lot of features like there is an agent handoff where you can let's quickly talk about pricing they are a bit expensive with these plans i believe you can create unlimited bots you can always get a free trial and see how that works and like i said if the client is willing you can even use this bot these are some of the data sources that you could add with oremon ai you can just type the website here or a sitemap get book pdf the next and final chatbot provider that we have is chatbase it's really similar to what we have seen with oremon ai except it is not really trained on a high quality sales data or support data or anything like that you can add these data sources on chatbase for pricing it's almost exactly the same except they have a free plan where you can use a chatbot and you can remove powered by chatbase brand branding for this much and extra messages will cost seven dollars per thousand messages everything is available on their websites if you want to learn more let's finally see what the comparison is between chatbase and oremon as well the features i really like what oremon is offering and ease of use definitely both of these bots are really used to use you can just give the website and it will be ready in a minute so ease of use both of them and pricing like i said unlimited bots on oremon and only 10 on chatbase it's night and day so oremon for the win like i said these bots are not to be used as a final delivery maybe to get your foot in the door that's a great way to use these bots and that's what i'm using them for but if your client is willing and happy with the responses that they're getting more power to you and that concludes the six bots that i am planning to use in my ai automation agency 
at the end of the day it's completely up to you so i strongly encourage you sign up for a trial or even the free plan make full use of the bot and follow some of my tutorials and see how to use each tool and let me know if you have any questions and if you haven't watched my challenge video so far you can watch this playlist next